Okay. All right. So I'm just doing the reviews. We're doing reviews today. Hello everyone! Hey! hey. <gasps> Welcome to the break room! I am Jerry and I'm John and today we're launching our very first episode of the Is It Worth It series. Yep, today we're actually gonna review some items that we bought online which are actually for, range from free, free to five dollars uh, uh, a little bit more than five dollars I guess Oh you got more Just a little bit, okay. not that much uh, 5.01 Oh that's easy Okay uh, We got it from a website called Temu <clears throat> um, They have all sorts of nice little products uh, they're very cheap too mm -hmm. uh, so we're gonna try them out and let you know if we think it's worth it yes so we're gonna start with our first item so which item are we gonna get first yours or mine um you wanna go with yours sure i'm gonna pick uh let's go with this one first okay Ta -ching! what is this <laughs> so this is called mischief, uh, mischief saving box So basically, it's a what do we call it? It's a piggy bank. It's a piggy bank, actually. So yeah. it's a um, piggy bank that has a cat in it. So let's open it up. So this is the box. Mm -hmm. Opening it up. There we go. If you could just grab that for me, John. Okay. Now for this review, we're actually gonna need another props, and that's gonna be coins. Since this is piggy bank, we're just gonna grab our coins here. So I'm um, gonna have just to turn it on. So the box itself looks like it's a cargo. Oh, it said something. Sorry, I didn't know that's actually gonna say something. So the box itself looks like it's a cargo box. So right here is actually where you press the button, and then a cat will come out and grab your uh, coins and store it inside the piggy bank. So let's do that. So I have a coin right here. Initially, I thought it would just put the coin and we'll do it, but no, you have to actually press it. Okay, we'll pick out, grab it. There you go. Very nice. How do you get it out? Oh yeah, actually, to get it out, there's actually a door here at the bottom. So you just basically twist it to open, and then you just basically shake it, and it comes out, and there's your coin. Wow. I don't know how much it will contain or actually store, but it seems like there's about a uh, space there somewhere. Yeah. What do you think, John? Um, I can store a million dollars there. A one mil? Yep. One million dollars. Um, Kitty dollars. Kitty dollars. Kitty dollars, I should say. Uh oh. Pigs. Oh. The cat's pretty cute. All right, what do you think, Jerry? Is it worth it? Uh, just by the cuteness and by the price. I'm actually gonna buy it. I know I'm just gonna play it for five minutes, and I'm probably <laughs> bored after that. But I still wanna buy it. How about you, John? Me? If it was a different color, I think I would buy it. Actually, the one that I wanna buy is um. Do you know uh, Princess Mononoke? Yeah. I do. So there is a monster there that gives the, uh, the coin, right? Or it's the coin? Do you remember that? The one with the mask? There's actually one of that. I forgot its name. Faces. And, uh, huh? Is it Faces? It's called Faceless. Faceless. Wait, Faceless. But okay. isn't that Spirited Away? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, it's a different anime, sorry. See, I know my anime. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I forgot, uh, I forgot that monster's name, but I was gonna buy that, but it's like $26 or $30, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. I know, but I still want to buy it though. On to the next one. On to the next one. Okay. I bought this because I wanted to get my head scratched. There you go. But John, how does it work? It works like this. Can you into me? Yeah. Can if I me? killed you, sorry. Yeah. It's okay. I will. Yeah, see? My fiance needs to do this. 
You like that, huh? That's good. good. <laughs> yeah. All right. It's really good. <laughs> Thank you, Jerry. That was a good massage. No problem. Um, this was probably a couple of cents. Really? Yeah. Oh, we should buy a lot. Then. I will put the price on on the screen. Yes. And if it's not a couple of cents, I apologize. Okay. But it's fairly cheap. And um, is it worth it? I would say it is if if uh, your significant other will do this for you. It's actually, uh, yeah, I've had it once. We had it once before. When you do it, what? For yourself, yeah. it's not the same. Oh, someone has to do yeah, it. Yeah, somebody else. Has it's to like do. someone's tickling you. Right? So you Our director is telling me to do it to Jerry. Please. Is it even working? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, it's actually really good. It feels pretty good, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna fall asleep. <laughs> Thank you, John. You're welcome. That was a good massage. <laughs> All right. That actually, it feels good. It's like someone's tickling your head, if you yeah. want to put it that way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I guess if you do it yourself, because you cannot tickle yourself, it's not gonna be as the same. That's true. So no. when you buy one, make sure you have someone who will do it for you. Uh, I'm sure you can rent somebody. If you don't have any. So that one is two cents. Renting someone might cost you a bit. Yeah. Okay. 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 Next one. Next one. Okay. I am gonna grab. Well, this one we're not gonna do, but I just want to show you guys. This is actually a puzzle. How many pieces? Actually, I don't know how many pieces it is. So if it's actually a wooden puzzle, this one is a wooden puzzle of a colorful parrot, as you can see right there. These are the pieces to it. Okay. And actually the fun part about this, if I can open it, all the pieces here is actually each piece is a shape of an animal. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, cool. Or that. I'll put it on top. Oh, doesn't work, sorry. Oh, this is a baboon. See, that's a baboon. This is, a, I'm assuming, either a wolf or a dog. And this is a squirrel. So yeah, it's gonna be actually interesting. What is this? Uh, no idea. See, besides from putting them together, you're gonna have, have fun guessing what animals are you putting into the puzzle. That is if fine. you guys want a different kind of puzzle, this is actually a good one. Because it's besides from a parrot, you're putting a building a parrot, you actually have animal parts to build that parrot. <laughs> nice. That makes sense? Sure. <laughs> are you gonna buy it? John, are you gonna buy it? Would I buy it? Yes, I actually would buy this. Yeah, it's actually interesting. Uh, um, my next one has not yet been opened. So I will open it. Ooh, what is that? So, do you ever go to your uh, morning routine and uh, have an issue with your toothpaste? Where you're not able to afford new toothpaste. Well, I have that problem sometimes. You're supposed to brush in the morning? Sometimes. Okay. Only on the weekends. Okay. Now I know. Um, so, when we can't afford uh, toothpaste, we want to use as much from the package oh. as much as possible. We I think I know waste. what this one is now. We can't waste it. Um, <clears throat> so, this is a fairly used up toothpaste. Uh, there's still a lot in it, actually, but I guess I'll try to see if this works. The edge of the toothpaste is kind of curved, so let's see how well. So you have to clip it at the edge, it's at the curved. end part. Pretty good for a curved edge. Slide it in, and then... doesn't work well with large tooth, uh, toothpaste containers uh, because it needs two people to open it. <laughs> <laughs> because yes, as you turn this, it uh, it starts hitting the uh, the, the edge of the yeah. So, so it's, it's basically to gonna. But the idea is, once you turn it, it actually gonna squeeze the right. toothpaste from the bottom to the top. top. 
So you say you're basically gonna use up. <coughs> you maximize. Everything. Yeah. Everything. Maximize everything. Is it worth it? If you, if you can't afford new <laughs> toothpaste, it is worth it. Yes. Yeah. It's always worth it, especially in, during a. Uh, Inflation. Inflation. You're right. That's the word I'm looking for. Well Inflation. done. Actually, I forgot about it. Yeah. Yeah. So, yes. Maximize everything. Yeah. So, the next item uh, I got is basically. Oh, that's pretty cool. For all the sci fi people over there, it's the. It's a Star Wars chopstick. Try them out. So, now we're actually gonna try it out. We have some chips right here. It up. Actually, John, this is a uh, two pair, so we. Oh, we oh it's have two pairs. Yeah. Very nice. And then I haven't actually uh, pulled the thing yet. Hopefully, it all works. <gasps> Fancy. Oh, this one is red, and this what? What, what color you get? We're in the dark side. <laughs> We're the Sith. All right, let's see if I still know how to do chopstick. Don't laugh at me. Hey! I can still pick it up. All right, let's try this. One go. Oh, you. John is Filipino, just in case you guys don't know. And we're not used to chopstick. If we have tinidor, yes. <laughs> then we or our hands, our hands will be good. At it. But yeah, it's good. It's good. This is this is. Uh, I like it. I would buy it. Yes. Jeff. I like this. I would. I. Uh, it's a little bit slippery. Oh. Oh what? It changes colors. See, I didn't even know that. Now I really, well, I already bought it, but if you guys want it, buy it. Oh, what? Oh! oh. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, this is what we're gonna Look just get away. That's, that's really cool. Sorry, we're gonna stop the video now. And, uh, well, John and I are just gonna play. John, I'm your father. I feel like those airport people. Let's make it, let's make it orange. Is this thing? Ooh, what is that? This thing is a cutter for apples. So it's supposed to cut the core in the middle, right here. Uh huh. And um. And then you'll get uh, what six? Is that six, seven, eight pieces of sliced? Uh, yes, eight. Uh, apple. Apple. So we're gonna try this out and I'll let you know if it's worth it. Thank you. So we have our chopping board or cutting board. Here and here we have an apple. Ooh. Let's see. All right, here it goes. <gasps> Still have all your fingers? I think so. Okay, good. <laughs> it's actually quite dangerous one. But look at that. But look at that. That's pretty good. You guys see that? I will say that it didn't cut through though, but it, it got it gets you started. Yes, it looks good though. Yeah, so now right. we can have apple uh, slices. Uh, okay. Let's see. Again, the taste of the apple doesn't. Oh crap, this wasn't- I'm actually uh, full, so I'm not gonna eat it. I, we forgot to wash the apple. Okay. Don't do that, kids. Yes. If you don't want to Always sick. wash your food. Yes. But I will swallow. <laughs> yes. So okay. That's your uh, <laughs> public service announcement for today. Always wash your food. Yep. Don't be like me. You may not see me in the next video. Uh oh. I don't want to do solo. <laughs> What's next? The next one would be... Is it worth it? Oh, is it yeah. worth it? Yes, it is. Is it worth it? Actually, I wouldn't say... 
For the price, it is. Yes. But would I really use it? No. Because I would just eat an apple. Yeah. Either bite it or just use a knife, cut it. Next one. Uh, is this my last one? Oh no, this is second to the last. So this part, we're actually going to need to turn off the light. One, two, three. Yeah. Ooh. Oh yeah. This is actually a uh, glow, not the glow. Right there. Yeah, right there. Right there. Merry Christmas, guys. We're just having so much fun over here. Oof. You see that? It's pretty cool. I yeah. like it. Would you buy it? Yes. I would buy it. Yeah. So this is... These are the glasses. Like. Yes. So yeah, it comes with a battery, of course. And then, I don't know, you're not gonna see it anymore. But, uh, it lights up. Okay! Yeah! Next one! I will need another cutting board with a knife. And another possible apple. Ooh, this one looks different. Of course, because it's different. So what is it then? It's supposed to help us cut uh, correct sizes of certain things. Oh! And you pick this. It doesn't come with instructions, so it's up to you to figure out how you want to yeah. cut it. But I I assume it's gonna go in the middle. Good. And then you take your knife. Maybe a little bit bigger. Yeah. It's up to you how uh, how much uh, thickness you want. I'm you want I'm for each of the uh, stuff you're cutting. I'm skipping every other. It works though. It does. Boom! End product. How do the chefs do it? I don't know. Do it. Ooh! You see that? I can now call myself a chef. There you go. Chef John. Yep. Is it worth it? No, it's not for me. I totally could do this without this thing. Yeah. <laughs> it might not be the same proportion, but you can yep. still cut it without that. What's next? So for my last item, I have to clear the table first. I'm gonna have to need a water. Water. I need water. I need the water. I don't know how this one works. Thank you. And surprisingly, I had bought the same exact thing. Ah! Instant underpants, just add water, one pair. It's only one pair in each, so if you need two, you have to buy more. It's morphin' time! There you go, what's the instruction actually? It says on the back, just add water. So again, <laughs> it looks like a small puck, a white one. So I don't know, did you have to need to just put it in, soak it in? So we just, so so. just soak it in? Yeah. I'm just gonna soak it in here. Let's see how long it takes. Yes. It is now seven and two. So supposedly this is for emergency usage, right? Right. But... but let's talk about that though. Okay, yeah. so if you need an emergency underwear, it would generally be because you've done something yeah. in it. There's right? a hole. Extra hole, I should say. Oh, a hole. I was thinking more of you poop your pants or oh. eat your pants or something. Where are you, a kid? Sometimes. But, um, so then if you get instant underwear, it's already, it's wet. See, that's actually what I was gonna say. Right. So, um, why would you change your wet underwear with another wet underwear? Right. Again, I'm still waiting for it. Okay. Oh, sorry. I'm making okay. a mess. And it looks like... Sorry. Wow, it looks like one of those... Um, hairnet? Yeah, a hairnet. Yeah. 
So, but this is what it looks like. Will you buy it? No. I wouldn't buy it. Will you wear it? Hell no. That is all of our items below $5. I love the website to move. Yeah. If you'd like to visit it, uh, there's a link in our description below. Um, so if you like this video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And click the notification bell so you know when we're uploading our next videos. See you next time. Bye.